Marijuana, not yet legal in New York State, but no matter for the NYPD, they've announced that they will stop arresting most people for possession of marijuana beginning this summer. John Shumo has the full story. John, what do you got? That's right, Bill. Uh, smoking marijuana in New York will soon be treated the same way as running a red light. Police will give most offenders a ticket pot smokers will not be arrested, most of them. The change in policy comes after a 30-day review by the NYPD at the direction of Mayor de Blasio. Police say almost 18,000 people are arrested every year on mar marijuana possession charges in New York City, most of them black and Hispanic. People of color are arrested at a rate of eight times the rate of white people over the last three years, despite government surveys that show whites use the drug at almost the same rate. Mayor de Blasio and Police Commissioner James O'Neill say the changes, which are set to take effect at the end of summer, can be made without jeopardizing public safety. I'm not there yet, and I'll tell you why. I think we need a regulatory framework uh, before that step is taken. Now, I think the reality is, in this state, the likelihood is next spring is when action would be taken. It's important to note there are exceptions. Police will arrest you if you're caught with pot and you're out on probation or parole, if there's an open arrest warrant against you, if you're driving or not carrying ID. This change in policy in New York City may be the same thing across New York State this time next year. On Monday, the state health commissioner said a study commissioned by Governor Cuomo will announce support for legalizing recreational marijuana in New York. Unlikely to happen until 2019. And of course, lawmakers in Albany will ultimately have the final say on that. Bill? All right, the debate rages on. But anyway, you won't get in too much trouble if you're smoking in New York. Thanks, John.